Hi and welcome to Cheeky Richo's Prawn Laksa. This is a Malaysian dish, it's very easy to do. It's made in a matter of moments using all fresh ingredients which are listed in the recipe box below. So let's get started. First thing that we're going to do, we've top and tailed our fresh beans and just cut them into about 35 or 40 millimeter pieces or about two inches. We're going to juice our lime. This is just fresh limes off our tree. The ingredients of this will have a, a hot, a sweet, a sour and a savoury component as with quite a few Asian dishes. We've got our rice noodles here, we've just boiled some water, we're going to cover those with some boiling water and just allow those to steep before we put them into our soup. Now these are our fresh prawns, they've already had the heads removed, we're just going to remove the skins. You can leave the tail intact if you like, I happen to think that's quite a nice piece of presentation. And put them to one side, so just I've showed you how to peel these in a different video. And that's what you should have. We continue with the rest. Okay, our prawns are done, we're just going to put those to one side. We've got some medium tofu here. If you've got fried tofu that's all the better, but we're just going to cut that into little cubes. And and toss that in sort of last thing. Don't use soft tofu here because it'll really go quite mushy. Okay, just put that to one side as well. Okay, over medium high heat we add our oil, our laxa paste. Now this will probably make you cough because as it starts fry, it'll be releasing all of its pungent flavors. So just send that in there now. You'll start to smell that pretty soon. And it's spitting a bit as well. Okay, now it's in with our onions, which have just been sliced. Our raw green beans, our chilies, it's been sliced as much or as little as you like there. Keep this turning because you don't want it to burn. Now we've got some palm sugar. I'm just going to use a microplane here because it's going to be quite easy. This is going to be the sweet component. About a quarter of a cake of that. I'm just going to grate some fresh ginger in here now. And all those lovely juices will be going in as well. Starting to smell pretty good. And that's it with our soy sauce, our fish sauce, our coconut cream, and some water. Just rinse out your coconut cream can with the water. Now this has literally been only going for a few moments. Now our water has boiled, so we're just gonna pour it all over our noodles and soften those. Push them underneath the surface of the water. Add our tofu now, and our prawns. And we just want those prawns to just gently cook. They'll go pink. You don't wanna overcook these because they'll become really quite tough. Our lime juice goes in now. I'm going to send in the pulp as well. There's no seeds in these limes. Waste not, want not. Okay, after about three minutes, everything's cooked. We just turn that off now. Our noodles are softening too. They need about 10 minutes or so. And it's time to plate up. Okay, it's time to plate up our steaming hot laksa. We're going to put some noodles in. They're perfectly cooked. Scoop in some of our delicious broth, making sure you get plenty of everything in there. And now we're going to dress it with some bean sprouts, some extra chili, some coriander, and some fried shallots. And there you have it, Chihi Richo's Prawn Laksa. Have a little taste, shall we? That is so good. And it's not too spicy. Those prawns have lent a beautiful sweetness to the dish with the palm sugar. The noodles are perfectly cooked. Thanks for watching.